Hello there guys, my name is Chris Shardog Stubborn, but built for theme park news. Now before we get started, shout outs go to Brian Galeas and George Costi Richmond, he wants to shout out. Uh, he's a big fan of the channel as well, so massive shout out to you guys. If you want to shout out in our future videos, comment down below. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video as well. And now let's zoom into the video. So this is from Volcania, this is an educational park in France that are really going around the futuriscope way. They're really trying to... Uh, move into the theme park route and they're doing it in a big way. Drop tower plan for 2024, we believe themed to tornadoes. A raft ride, we believe themed to maelstroms for 2026 being planned. And also we've got this 2021 roller coaster. I know we're going forwards and then going way back, but 2021 is the planned year for an Intamin LSM launch family coaster with a very special element that I'll talk about. So this coaster is set to have a height of 16 meters, so not very tall at all, so I'm guessing they're going to go again, the Futuriscope route of story. Um, it's got a length of 580 meters of track, and it's also set to have a drop track element, which is uh, something I'm going to talk about, uh, and I'm going to compare a couple of coasters here. Now, of course, the ride is set to open on the 13th of March, 2021. Uh, and I think it's going to be a fantastic addition to the to this uh, new educate well not new but educational park turn theme park. Uh, they're really going along the uh, theme park route here. Now, one big thing to mention is this ride will be themed to earthquakes. Now, I think that explains the drop track element. I think it's going to um, going to this like cave building or just some kind of building. Uh, the ground shakes, the earthquake noises start to happen. I think in terms of Richter scale, I'm hoping it's going to be like the one uh, in the actual earthquake film and also the one that was on the old Earthquake the Big One attraction at Universal Studios Orlando, which they described as an 8.2 on the Richter scale earthquake. Uh, I'm hoping to go with that sort of style earthquake so we can get the full atmosphere for it. Uh, and then I think the drop track will happen in, during that earthquake bit. I think the earthquake is the drop track. Uh, so... I'm really excited to see what they're going to do with this in terms of storyline and theming. Now, I know I've seen, I've actually seen pictures and videos of Volcania's educational attractions, like the volcano drones or volcan volcanic drones, I think it's called. Uh, either volcanic drones or volcano drones, something like that. Um, I've seen their educational attractions and they look brilliant. So I think Volcania are going to be fine in terms of theming because they can theme their educational attractions very, very well. Uh, one other big thing to mention here is, of course, the manufacturer, Intamin, and, of course, the addition of an LSM launch. Now, interestingly, I think this is Verbolton, but manufactured by Intamin. Now, of course, 13 is a big inspiration for the drop track. If you don't know what 13 is, opened at Alton Towers in 2010. It's a drop track coaster. It's a family coaster. It's SW6, Secret Weapon 6, on the old side of the corkscrew in Dark Forest, used to be known as Ugland. Um... You know, that's quite a family coaster. No launch, but it's got that drop track element. But the reason I say Intamin manufactured Verbolton, now Verbolton is actually a Ziera launch family track drop coaster uh, that opened in 2012 uh, in the old Big Bad Wolf site in Oktoberfest in Busch Gardens, Williamsburg in Williamsburg, Virginia. Now Verbolton is a great family thrill coaster with that launchers, the two launchers and the drop track as well as all the twists and turns and also paying homage to the Big Bad Wolf with that final drop towards the Rhine River before turning back into the station. Um... You know, it's got me, it's given me Intamin manufactured Verbolton vibes with this. I think it's going to be quite a family thrill coaster. Nothing on the extreme style, but think, think Verbolton, but manufactured by Intamin, like I've said in the past. So uh, I think Volcania are really going to sort of think about the whole style of this and what they're going to do with it. Um, so I, I'm really excited about that. Hopefully a name comes out next year during the 2020 season when they start to promote and manufacture and market the ride. So... Um, like we said about the opening day, expect this ride to open on the 13th of March 2021. Volcania, if you don't know where this is, this is located in Rhône-Alpes, France. So if you want to book tickets, I'm going to put the website in the description down below uh, so you can book tickets. Uh, but I would recommend booking tickets in 2021 if you want to ride the coaster. If you want to check out the educational attractions before the coaster opens, I'd book a ticket right now. I, I think it's a really cool 
uh, little attraction. I think they've got some really good stuff going. I think the educational attractions look splendid. If you want to learn some stuff about volcanoes and other things, then I'd really recommend this attraction. So uh, make sure you go and uh, look at the website in the description down below. Thank you so, so much for watching this little update from Volcania 2021. Make sure you check out for more possible construction updates released by the park. Uh, then if, if there's any construction updates released by the park or any details revealed about the coaster, then I'll bring them to you in separate updates. But for now, guys, thank you very, very much. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. And for now, guys, my name is Ghost Gel. Keep it on the coaster life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care. Have an awesome day, my friends.